Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? I'm back with another video. In today's video, we're gonna be going over the... Actually, I can't tell you what we're going over yet. It's actually a surprise, but... I don't know if I'm gonna be putting the title of this sneaker in the description, but just know that there's an upcoming pair of dunks that are releasing that is the same colorway of the sneakers that I'm about to show you guys soon. Just know that there's so much hype going around on this pair of dunks that are about to release. I thought about clickbaiting you guys. I don't know, I could still if I wanted to, but um, I ain't gonna do that to y'all. I ain't gonna do that to y'all. Y'all, you guys, you guys actually support me and stuff like that, so I don't wanna clickbait y'all, and then y'all just come at me with all this hate or whatever. Just know that these pair of sneakers that I'm about to show you is from my home state, and some of you that watch my videos and know me in real life, you guys know what state I was born in, and uh, people that don't know me in real life that support me, you guys may know, because I know I've said it multiple times in a few videos, but um, yeah, enough with the blah, blah, blah. Let me grab this sneaker and show you guys what I have in store for you. Probably one of my favorite Air Jordan ones. Boom! Check them out, I got them early. SB Dunks, no I'm playing. This is actually the Air Jordan 1 mid Michigan colorways. These actually released seven years ago and I was doing some research on YouTube and I actually noticed that there wasn't even a review done on this sneaker. Like it was just a video of like somebody unboxing it but it wasn't a review. I decided, pick these up off one of my homies. He actually let me get them for a steal. I know they look kind of, I mean, they don't even look kind of beat but here, here's a 360 the sneaker. I'll let you guys look at it. I'll really say the only flaw in this sneaker is probably the, the lace tip and um, on the hill, on the hill tab. Uh, here we have like a little scuff marks and stuff like that. Hopefully the camera can pick that up. Honestly, there's not that many flaws about this sneaker. Um, creases, they look fire on feet. I can't wait to show you guys what they look like on feet. I actually wore these to a party and I got a lot of compliments on like where did I get these at. And I guess a lot of people don't know that these are actually a pair of Jordans that released seven years ago. I went to my friend's house and he had them sitting in his room and I was like, yo, like let me get these off you. And he was like, all right, give me such and such and you can have them. And I was like, all right, for sure, bet, let's do it. Uh, let me grab the other sneaker for you guys. Here's the left shoe. I just got done showing you guys the right shoe. Here's the hill tab. This this, this heel tab also has scuff marks on it. I know at the bottom of the shoe, there's not really that much grip, although it looks like it, but when I was uh, when I was getting down on the dance floor, I was out there slipping. I was moonwalking easily because these did not have grip on it. But you know, that's okay. They are seven years old, but for a seven year old sneaker in this condition is great. So yeah, go blue and let me give you guys a closer look at the sneaker and then I'll give you guys an on foot review. So here's a closer look at the sneaker. I'm just gonna give you guys a 360 so you guys can see what's going on here. Here's the toe box area. Just gonna keep rotating this around. Let me know in the comment section if you guys think these are beat or not. I, I wouldn't say they're beat. They're for seven years old. These are in a straight condition. But let me know in the comment section what you think. And without further ado, let's get these on feet for you guys. Make sure if you haven't yet, click that subscribe button, leave a like. It helps out the channel a lot. Also, share this video with a friend. It really helps out. I appreciate you guys for supporting me. Peace. Hey, Nathan, you made this.